Hey everyone, welcome back to Rex TV. Today, we need to talk about a recent development in Zimbabwean politics that has caught the attention of Western diplomats. It has been reported that some Western diplomats have given up on Nelson Chamisa, the leader of the Citizens Coalition for Change, CCC, and have even gone as far as calling him incomplete or a front for the ruling ZANU-PF party. If this is your first time to this channel I'm begging you to subscribe, share and like for more updates let's go. This is a significant development considering that Western support and recognition play a crucial role in shaping international opinion and influencing policies in Zimbabwe. Chamisa, who has been a prominent figure in opposition politics in Zimbabwe, has been seen as a potential leader who could bring about much needed change in the country's political landscape. However, Recent events, including the formation of the CCC, have raised concerns among Western diplomats about Chamisa's ability to lead a credible opposition movement. Some have even suggested that the CCC may be a ZANU-PF front, designed to divide and weaken the opposition. This shift in attitude towards Chamisa and the CCC is not only a blow to their credibility but also raises questions about the future of the opposition movement in Zimbabwe. With Western support dwindling, it may become increasingly difficult for the CCC to gain international recognition and support, which could hinder their ability to effectively challenge the ruling party. It's important to note that these are just allegations and accusations, and it's crucial to approach this news with a critical eye. However, the fact that Western diplomats are starting to distance themselves from Chamisa and the CCC is a concerning development that could have far-reaching implications for Zimbabwean politics. What do you think about this recent development? Do you believe that Chamisa is an incomplete leader or a front for the ruling party, as some Western diplomats have suggested? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. As always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on this developing story. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.